life-changing stories, people whose lives have been transformed by the gospel of Jesus Christ. It's you that gives us the ability to tell these stories. It's you that gives us the ability to share the faith, the hope, and the love. It's you that give us the ability to engage with our culture biblical responses. Please continue to give us that ability by giving today. Please call us at one 288 3 with a generous gift to help 100 Huntley Street as we now face this August year end fiscally. Or you can go online with a secure online donation at 100huntley.com. You know, we love the Word of God and we want to motivate people when it comes to the Scriptures. Recently, our friends at the Evangelical Fellowship of Canada as well as, as, as the Bible League came together and they put together a, a, a survey. I want to show you some data about how Canadians are responding to the Word of God. And if you look at this, it's, 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 it's pretty discouraging. There's some good things out of this, but there's some alarming things out of this. Here, here's what the Bible Forum and EFC discovered. Only 18% of Canadians strongly agree that the Bible is the Word of God. That's down 35% in two decades. Wow. 66% of Canadians agree that the scriptures of all major relig religions teach essentially the same thing. Therefore, the uniqueness of Jesus Christ, if you will, is, is marginalized or seen as not very important. Let's look at the next slide. Bible study groups provide the social frame for discussion, processing, sharing, and prayer. So when, when, when people are getting together and they, they study the Word of God, that, that becomes a, a, a context, that becomes an environment, a, a laboratory where people can grow and understand the things of faith. The survey also says that when we are accountable to someone with our Bible reading practices, it positively influences our Bible engagement. Again, the whole idea here of, of, of being together with others, studying the Word, how that not only redemption in Christ takes place, but being around the Word of God can lift you. And as well, there, there are other data and statistics that say that people that will study the Bible, people who are influenced by faith in Jesus Christ, just have more meaningful lives. They find more purpose in life. One more frame here I want you to look at. The percentage of frequent Bible readers in Canada has dropped in the past two decades. 11% we are weekly readers, down from 21% two decades ago. It says that only 11% of Canadians reflect on the meaning of the Bible in their lives. Now that is the framework in which we bring 100 Huntley Street every single day. The Lord in the midst of all of this kind of challenge and the diminishing importance of the Bible societally, in the context of all that, 100 Huntley Street is here, and we have a responsibility every single day. We consider it a high and holy privilege to present biblical truth from communicators who are clear and compelling about biblical truth, how it applies to family, how it applies to life, how it applies to finances, how it applies to parenting, every kind of avenue of life speaking to issues today from a biblical worldview. Now, in the midst of a culture where the Bible is being increasingly diminished, imagine no 100 Huntley Street every day. Imagine that. Imagine what it would be like not to have the program here where you have faithful host, faithful guest, with content that makes a difference. We need your help today. Would you help 100 Huntley Street advance, not retreat, advance into the future? We need your help today. Call us, would you? 1-888-288-0003, one 288 3 or you can make a secure online donation to 100huntley.com. Help us keep the Word of God engaged in Canadian culture.